Hey guys, what is going on? It is me, TTG, baby, and just like the title says, stop watching best class setup videos. I'm about to lay the truth down on you, like always. But before we get into it, guys, I just want to say that I've been on a hiatus, a little two-week hiatus. I've been on vacation, but I am back for the long run right now so let's get into it why should you stop watching best class setup videos well i have a few reasons why you should stop watching best class setup videos now best class setup videos are made by youtubers they're probably the most popular little series that youtubers do but I am going to tell you right now why they don't always work out. And I'm going to give you the reasons why you should stop watching them. I think me and Exclusive Ace are like the only Call of Duty YouTubers that instead of doing best class setup videos, we do ideal class setup videos. And just because it works for them does not mean it works for you. So let's get into the reasons. Reason number one. This skill gap. Guys, when you're watching best class set of videos, watch how the other team not only reacts, but look at their skill. Um, most of these YouTubers are playing, you know, low levels, whether it be Christmas noobs or people that, you know, just got the game in February or March. Uh, their skill level is not good. Like, they're like what we call, are you ready for this? four-year-olds with no thumbs you know their reaction time is garbage their you know their aim is crap they're just playing bad people and it doesn't matter what class setup you're using against people that aren't good at this game any gun will work so keep an eye when you're watching these best class setup videos keep an eye on how good or how bad the other team is because like I said it's not the best class setup. It's not the gun. It's the person holding the controller. And if you're playing bad people, then you're going to have a good game whatever gun you are using. Now, the next reason I am going to drop the truth on you. The next reason. Guys, these Call of Duty YouTubers like myself. Guys, we might have the small advantages that you do not have. You know, I'm talking about a one millisecond response gaming monitor. I'm talking about a custom controller with trigger stops and tension sticks. And, you know, back A and B buttons. Back X and square, circle, triangle, Y. You know, all those buttons buttons we, you know we have control freaks we have all of that we have good internet we might be hardwired with a, you know it, we might be hardwired with our control we might have those small advantages that you don't have you know and the gaming monitor itself if you're not, if you're not playing on a gaming monitor playing on a TV is really bad the, the lag comp the display lag all that, the latency of the response time is going to be bad. And if you can see and react to your enemy before they can see you on screen, on time, in real time, you're going to win the gunfights. And if you don't have that advantage, that class setup might not work for you. Now, another reason, guys, and this is the biggest reason of them all. Watch how that YouTuber plays. You know, if, if he... If a YouTuber comes out and if they come, you know, if they make a quick scope and best class setup and you can't quick scope, what good is that going to do to you? You know, if you can't quick scope, that class setup is not going to work for you. If they come out with a Type 100 or an MP40 best class setup and you don't play aggressive, and you don't flank and you don't rush, that best class setup might not work for you. So watch how they play. You know, some of these YouTubers, like, you know, I'll name some, the Green Goblin, um, Exclusive Ace, uh, Mark of J, Swag, Korean, they all are good enough to be pro Call of Duty players. You know, they can jump shot. They can drop shot. They can quick scope. You know, they, they pre-aim. They have the smarts. You know, they have they have the intangibles that you have when you're a professional Call of Duty player. And you know, if if you if you don't rock those, if you don't have those intangibles, that best class setup might not work for you. You know, like I said, if they're rocking an assault rifle best class setup, if they come out and say, Oh, use this uh bar class setup, I'll guarantee you you drop a nuke. 
Well, if you haven't dropped a nuke with any other gun be before that, chances are you're not going to drop a nuke with this gun just because, you know, your favorite YouTuber says to use this best class setup. Like I said earlier in the video, it's not the class setup, it's the person holding the controller. Um, so those are main reasons why you should stop watching best class setup videos, and I'm going to be dropping a video probably tomorrow on how to make and how to find your, your perfect class setup. I will go over how you can find your go-to gun, your go-to perks, your go-to attachments, everything like that. And stuff, and, and you know, this stuff, you're gonna be, you're gonna find out on your own. You're not gonna listen to me, you're not gonna listen to anyone else, you're gonna find it on your own to make your perfect class setup, guys. Anyways, the gameplay in the background is a game of hardpoint on the map, Valkyrie. I'm really digging these uh, new maps, I really love them I totally forgot what I went in this in this game I think it was close to 40 kills um, less than 15 deaths and like two minutes in the hard point so I definitely played objective um, so I'm gonna leave you with the rest of this gameplay guys and like I said I will drop that video on how to find your perfect class setup probably tomorrow um, I'm back for the long run I'm gonna be uploading every single day so for those of you who missed me I am back for those of you who didn't miss me well I'm still back baby anyway stay cool fool don't hate eat some cake thick thighs and bright eyes and as always guys keep on grinding Searching for targets. Recon flight concluded. Sending motor rounds. Zone and sweep. Hardpoint is being overrun. Need reinforcements. Thank you for watching the video guys, I appreciate all the love and support you guys show me. Don't forget to do what the screen says, like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Also, please follow me on my social media links. Thank you guys and have a great day.